Hey guys, okay, this is like a super little grocery haul, but it cost me like $50. I'm not even kidding, like $53 for this little amount of food. How can people afford to eat? I sometimes wonder how we are able to afford to eat. But some of the ingredients that I bought aren't things I typically buy, like bacon. Um, but I'm making some new recipes in this new Kasori multi-cooker that Kasori sent me. And I'm kind of excited about this little bad boy. I feel like he can do everything. So I wanted to try some of their recipes and see how they panned out. Plus, Easter is this weekend. So I am making some pickle roll-ups and some ham or pickle roll-ups and some tortilla roll-ups. That's what I bought those for. But I'll just run you through everything that we got. Um, we got some bagels, chicken broth, olives, uh, cauliflower medley, ham, cream cheese, Brussels sprouts, bacon, eggs, this, this, un unicorn limited edition cereal, I'm pretty sure cute little cupcakes mom got us suckered into that one. Um, <laughs> and then some tortillas, green chilies, this peach nectar stuff. Is this juice like you would just drink it out of the can? Or is that just a simple like opening and you're supposed to use it as an ingredient? It was right next to the tortillas. So it was in a weird spot. I don't know what you do with it. But Bella thinks it's like a pop and she wants to try it and drink it. So that's what we got. Um, some green onions and pickles, of course, for the pickle roll-ups. Some more soy sauce and then some hoisin sauce. Now, I had to look up what is similar to oyster sauce because I'm not a fan of oyster sauce. And they said the vegan alternative is hoisin sauce. We're not vegan. Clearly, we're not vegan. <laughs> but... Um, there's just some things that I prefer the vegan alternative, to be completely honest. Like mayo. I don't like normal mayo. I like the mayo that has, like, the egg, like, on the thing. I don't know what it's called. But that is the mayo. It is the best mayo I've ever had. And it's vegan, so whatever. All you vegans out there, you, you have some foods that are way better than the normal stuff. And... You know, I'm slowly incorporating vegan things. Not so vegan there. So I'm sorry if you're vegan and you're watching this and this is making you really sad. That's not my intentions. But anyway, this is our little haul. And keep an eye out if you haven't, if I haven't already posted it, the Kasori video. Hey guys, okay, this is just a really super quick haul. Um, this is basically what I'm going to be throwing in Bella's lunches this week. Maybe on these two. I can't guarantee these two are going to go in there. But definitely the rest will be headed in her lunch. Oh, that one is for, um, we're going to make cake. So I was thinking about just adding whipped topping for the frosting. I don't know. It sounded I, good to me. And I really love cake with... Cream. Yeah. Cream yeah, so that's what we're going to do. You know, when you make the cake with just a can of pop, that's our plan. <laughs> um, and then some of this crabby crab, 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 fake crab, <laughs> imitation crab, but we like it. Uh, some water chestnuts. Those are for chicken salad. I'm going to make that uh, hopefully this week and get a video out for you super quick. Um, and then some cream cheese. Let me just go through everything because I don't know what I've said now. So cream cheese, SpaghettiOs, baby corn, $5,000 yogurt, cheap, cheap, cheap yogurt, uh, whipped topping, bread in the back, bread, tortillas, and the crab. water chestnuts, fake crab, and pudding and pudding, chocolate and vanilla. So... That is what we picked up tonight. I'm going to quickly make Bella's lunch. And that's all. Thanks for watching. <laughs> da, da, da. All right. So if you were in our live stream, you noticed our chocolate was like super messy. Look it. It's all in our fridge. It so, is not my fault. Well, here's what I think happened. Okay, this is clean. Take it. Um... I think it got put away in the fridge and the chocolate sauce, the lid was not on tight enough. So, yeah. 
Ew is right. At least it's all like in one little spot, right? Yeah. I don't even, I wish I would have used a baby wipe on this actually, because then I could have just chucked it. You can suck that. This washcloth? Mm -hmm. No. It's cleaned. Praise the Lord. Now we'll just put all stuff back into here. All right, there's our fridge.